So I know it's not Tuesday, it's not in the morning, but I wanna encourage somebody using Christmas lights, is that okay? There are two homes. One home is in a uh, more affluent neighborhood. It has lights all over it, lights all over the garage, and a sign out front that says, turn to this radio station, and the lights are synchronized with the music. So neat. Then there's another house that's in a less affluent neighborhood. However, it has the same lights, it has the same sign, and the music is synchronized with the lights on that house as well. Here's the difference. The house in the affluent neighborhood is on seven days a week. You can pop up any given night and there you'll see the lights on display and hear the music and it's synchronized and it's wonderful. Then the, you have the second house that's not in the affluent neighborhood. It's intermittent. You don't know when the lights are going to be on. You could pop up any given moment and the lights might not be on. The power source may not be connected. What does this have to do with anything? As believers in Christ, we all have a light, but here's the difference. The amount of power you have connected into is the amount of illumination you will be able to have. What do I mean by that? If you are connected to the power source consistently and you're able to pay the cost to do so, when people access you, they're going to get a consistent powerful light. It's not going to be intermittent. It's not going to be like people don't know how to take you from one day to the next because you're not willing to pay the cost in order to be illuminated. I hope somebody's catching this tonight. I just want to encourage you that you have the same ability to connect into the same power source. The difference is, are you willing to pay the cost? Are you willing to make the sacrifice? Do you just want to settle for or almost or halfway or somewhat like or do you want to be authentic in Christ and allow your light to shine through I sure hope you do I'm TG Thornton I hope you have a blessed and wonderful evening God bless you